friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Kale Fennell and I'm back with a video. In today's video, I'm doing a TikTok hack for doing press on nails. I saw this video, I'm gonna show you guys right now. Like just a little bit in there, dip it in there. Wait for it to set. Okay, so I saw this video and I was like, I have to do that. Like. She's mad, like she to go making press-ons last for like two to three weeks, period. Gotta save the coins to do bigger things with the coins. Oh, <laughs> you can't be sweet. Dropping 100, 200, $300 on your nails every two weeks, you feel what I'm saying? Let's just get into the freaking video. Okay, so first you're gonna wanna start by getting these products. I have some clear translucent powder, um, super nail, and this is from the beauty supply store, it was just $6. But um, I definitely recommend getting the clear one because if you use colors, it's gonna show up in, it's gonna show up underneath. So definitely make sure you use clear powder. Next, you're gonna wanna get this super glue from Dollar Tree, um, the one with the red cap. It works super, super good. And it does actually say, well, not on this, I don't think, but on the box, it says that it is for nails, so it is nail safe. Then, of course, you wanna have your press-ons. I like to use these Masterpiece ones. They're $11.99 from the beauty supply store. I feel like they're perfect because they're super long and um, they cover my entire finger. As you can tell, I have like really long nail beds. But yeah, you wanna start with your press-ons and these are the extra large kind. And of course, you wanna start with fresh, clean nails. Mine look a little crazy right now because you know when you take nails off, like it just be getting crazy. Your nails just be so thin and brittle, but make sure you start with fresh, cut down, clean nails. And then we're gonna start with the next part. So we're gonna take our nails out of the box and we're just gonna fit some of our nails to our finger just so that they're already laid out. So I'm gonna go off camera and do that and then we're gonna come back. Okay, now that I have my nails all laid out for the ones that are gonna fit my specific nails, you also wanna have some type of like flat surface like this. I'm just gonna use a piece of cardboard. But then you're gonna want to use your super glue And sometimes it gets like too glued in or whatever, like it's stuck. So I just use an earring to, you know, open that up. Now I'm just gonna take my thumbnail, put some glue on there. And press it deep and down. And then hold. You wanna hold for like 15 seconds or so. And you also just wanna like press the air bubbles out as much as you can with some of the nails that you get cause sometimes they're like very air bubbly. We're gonna do the acrylic powder in the nail tip after I put the rest of the nails on. So just hold on tight, okay? So I think they look pretty good so far. We still have to do the acrylic bottom, but like I said, we're just putting the nails on first. So let me go ahead and do the other side. Okay, now that we have both sets on, or oops, sorry. Now that we have both sides of our nails on, we look, you need to just shave that part down, but then we can start putting our acrylic powder. Now we are taking the, the clear acrylic powder. And like I said, I got this from the beauty supply store. All right, so we're gonna take this little clear board, have that here on the side, and then have your nail glue. You're gonna wanna put like a 
dot in there and if your nail rises up a little bit like mine does then you're gonna want to make sure the nail the glue gets behind there and you're just gonna put that in there and then I like to just add a couple of drops of glue just to really lock it in You see how it's like going clear like that? So yeah, you just want it to set and dry before you do anything, okay? Which it doesn't take too long. Just make sure you let it set and dry. But you see that? Now it's an acrylic nail, boom. And then I'm gonna dust off the other side. I might as well just do that now with a little brush. just because you want to keep it clean. But yeah, now this piece is like attached to my nail. And we're just gonna smooth that out just to make sure it's smooth. You can tell it's nice and smooth in there. And we're just gonna let that dry. But this one, like the powder, it didn't fully get submerged like wet, but the top is wet, so it's still fine. And honestly, nobody's gonna be under my nails like that anyway, so it's whatever. But we're just gonna put some more glue here and just keep it moving. But yeah, you see I'm just trying to get it as submerged as possible. My finger's stuck to this now, guys. <clears throat> For the other side, you just wanna dust off the extra powder that might have been left. And then you just want to keep repeating the process. So I'm going to shut up now and let you guys just watch. Hey, 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 see these niggas. So this is the final result of how the nails came out and they're not going anywhere I still have like a little bit of that stuff on me but that's because it, it just takes time this can be a little messy but it really just takes practice to get your nails on the way that they need to be without getting nail glue on the top part of the nails as you can see I got like a little bit right there but Whatever, it's cool. I can just use some acetone and clean that up. But I think overall they look really, really good. Super elegant, super fancy. And sorry, my dog is closing my door. Um, but yeah, I think that's just going to wrap up this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video of me do these press-on nails. And shout out to the girl from TikTok. I'm going to tag her video down below because she snapped. If you guys enjoyed watching this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. And leave me comments down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!